popping. It is a boy SOS snag. And as you guys can tell, probably by the video title, that new drops in Triple Threat Offline came. And I'm going to show you what I got from these drops. Or what I got from, like, these players, if I pulled any or not. As you can see, we don't open up the vault there, which is, okay. Let's fuck it. What sucks. But... And I didn't get anything, these are the only things I got before. Things, two quantum packs, one gold consumables pack, and then one uh, diamond consumables pack. I'm just showing you what we're getting in them. And then I will probably, most likely, sell these things, because I have no use for them. So, yeah. <sighs> Anyways, guys, I'm also going to be uploading kind of daily or as much as I can. So, tomorrow I got a good video coming out. It's going to be... I forget what it's going to be. Oh, yeah, it's going to be No Money Spend uh, Episode 2. Grind to uh, Jerry Smith. That's probably coming out maybe tomorrow, or the day before, or the day after tomorrow, on Friday, maybe even Saturday, who knows. But I definitely have to get him for you, and I'm showing you. I just sold that because I have no use for it. Um, but, yeah, that's basically what I'm going to be doing. And I will show you the updated squad, and we're going to be getting some new players on it. So I'm going to put my things on here. In this case, I'll just spend contracts on them. I guess I have to add one too. So, yeah, as you can see, this is a squad. And I did get the glitch market. I will show you guys that right here. And I got this Miles Turner glitch rewards. And I could have got and I opened a whole bunch of glitch packs, but those didn't really help at all. And he's six eleven center. If you do get him in the thing in the glitch market definitely get him he's good 80 driving lane up 90 post fade 90 post hook 90 post moves 85 draw foul 94 close shot his three points good for a center 92 free throw as well driving dunk uh pass iq ball handle pass accuracy you get the whole thing 93 rebounding all around and yeah Check out his badges real quick. He's there's grace A plus A plus A plus C plus A Excuse me A plus A plus A plus C A plus and A plus overall Hall of Fame catch and shoot corner specialist pick and popper post spin technician drop stepper put back ball slop city finisher rim protector box clamps Intimidator moving truck pogo stick post move walk down tireless defender back down punisher consistent finisher deep hooks pick and roller Pro Touch, Dream Shake, Flexible Release, Green Machine, Hot Zone Hunter, Hot Start, Ice in the Veins, Pump Fake, uh, Maestro, Range Extender, Brick Wall, and that's it for all the fame. First Golds, he's got 19, Acrobat, Relentless Finisher, Break Starter, Pick Dodger, Chase Down Artist, Defensive Leader, Heart Crusher, Rebound Chaser, Worm, Contact Finisher, Cross Key Score, Fancy Footwork, Bailout, Downhill, Quick first step, clutch shooter, deep fades, tireless shooter, volume shooter, and then he's also got a laid back uh, mental uh, badge, with laid back, chill player who is not easily riled. And uh, I would probably say our best player, it says on their top three is obviously um, Deron Williams. D-Ron, comment down below what his name is, Deron, D-Ron, D-Aron, because I, I call them Deron, but yeah, I'm just going to go with Deron. So, 
He's pretty good as well. Stats. Especially if you do have under 50k or 50k, definitely get this card. He's very good on next gen. Uh, apparently, current gen, which I'm playing on, he isn't too good. But in my opinion, I like him because he's good. I'm not going to name us Hoff Badge, but I will go down the list here. As you can see, he's got 36 Hall of Fame, 15 gold, and 1 bronze. So these are his badges. Done with the 36 Hall of Fame. And here's the 15 gold. And then he's got multiple uh, mental badges as well. But, I'm going to play one triple threat game with you guys, where I'm mostly going to be scoring threes, and then I'm going to conclude the video. Because, I ain't got mu nothing much, just wanted to show you what I got after playing four hours, even though I didn't really get anything. But, I need to do some of the challenges and the challenge agenda. By the way, the best time to get, um, Galaxy Opal... Or Dark Matter, Gary Smith. It's probably on Saturday for me because I'm level 37. Probably get those after new things coming out. Reversing Dark Matter, Derek Rose, Galaxy Opal, Michael Reed, and Dark Matter. Taco Fall. These are the agenda trackers that I need to do. I definitely need to get one of the score 25 three pointers to trade out over multiple games or whatever. So first, they start off with the ball wearing the Lakers jerseys. Derek Rose coming down the court. Get stuff by Artis Gilmore. Deron Williams step back on D. Rose. Shoots. Green's a three. 9% cover. And tell me if I should use no meter or meter. Tell me which one's better in your guys' opinion. Because I would love to know that. Because I need... To, I, I'm wondering if I should use the meter or no meter. Like... No meter snag or meter snag. But I usually use the meter, as you can see there. Ron Williams, like I said, very good. 3.2, he's also really good on defense, except with, like, kind of blocking in, in the paint. Even though they aren't the best, but as you can see there, the blocks don't really, aren't too good. That's why they're a B. Shoots, makes a three, or two, sorry. Guess that was a two. Ron Williams picks him up. Ooh, step backs on him again. Step back again. Shoots that, makes it. He's just deadly from that area. That's all you can say. He's really definitely around the court. He's got a good dunk package as well. Definitely a good player to get, I would say. Brandon Ingram is also good, but he's kind of way too overpriced. He goes for like 84000 You know, he's a flash 8 player. Which was, I think, a month ago or so. Or a month and a while. A month and some days or some weeks ago. Like, he's just way too overpriced for going for like 84000 But that's for me. Because I'm thinking of selling him. Because I'll show you what I have on the... I have... Um, D. Wade going up on the auction house, same with uh, this Galaxy Opal Chris Paul and uh, Diamond Kitchino Mobley that came out the other day. I got done with those challenges, so now I'm just selling those guys. And I'm, yeah, trying to make them bank. So after that, I have like 30,000 right now in MT. After that, I'll probably already have 100,000. And I'm assuming I'm going to. Put Brandon uh, Ingram up for auction for like eighty thousand. No, buy now, eighty thousand bid, and then see if he goes over a hundred thousand, and then I can buy him, or I can sell him and then get a hundred thousand out of that. Hopefully, which would bring me like two hundred thousand something, and then I can get like another dark matter and like Tracy McGrady or something like that. Even though they don't go for Low amount. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, anyways, guys. That's all I want to show you. Make sure to like and subscribe. And peace out. Bye. I'm going to show you the vault thing first. If we open it. Let's see what we get. 
Let's see what we get. Probably a thousand coins, like usual. Let's see. Nope! Galaxy Opal Trey Young, baby! That's what I'm talking about! There you go. There's the opening on that. And then, oh, let's go here. I knew something good was coming out of that. Woo! Let's go, baby. That's how you end it off in the right way. Number 11 from Mystery Pack, Point Guard, Eastern Carvins, overall 98. Peace!